Welcome back and today I'll be showing you guys 5 cheats and strategies to beat the Super Bowl comeback challenge event in Madden Mobile 24. So without further ado, let me get straight into it. So the number one thing you guys want to do is simply remember that there is only 2 quarters. You're down 28 to 3. The quarters lanes are a minute and 30 seconds long. And what you have to do is try to score every single play and get the ball back on every defensive play. And just play smart okay now what you want to do is find that special play on offense because you're playing offense first if you find that special play you're going to perform on offense every single time and score that's what you want to do you want to score on offense you want to score on your two-point conversion plays you want to get the touchdown you want to get the two points you want to get as many points as possible so here we go i love to do four verts i hear a lot of people doing wide receiver corner or something else in that kind of category of a certain play they like to do. But I think four verts is like the number one play. So I used to, when I won the event on my first try, I had Tyreek at B, I had Harrison at X. So I'm gonna switch it this time and go X Tyreek. So yeah, I'm gonna throw it over here. And it's not a true 7,999 overall guys because Tyreek's easily catching the ball, right? The defensive players are not really playing defense as much. I can literally score as fast as possible it's not that hard to do look at that simple one two touchdown sometimes you can get it on your first try right you want to try to get it on your first try because you don't want to waste as much time now for the two point play i love to do running plays full back dive i think that's a good play if you want to do like a throwing play long pass twin combos is good you would throw to the running back but run full back dive Fullback dive up the middle. It should be open every single time. And if it isn't open every time, I would switch it up if you don't get your first try. Because if it doesn't work, you want to make sure you get all the rest of the two-point conversions. If you don't get it on the first time, it's all right, okay? It's just one two-point miss. But you want to make sure you're always getting it. If you do not get a certain play, you can always swipe out the app, go back to the app, and you'll be on that same play. And that has something to do with the next thing. So number two, we got onside kicking. I don't really like onside kicking, right? But with like closing the app and redoing it, you can do that. I just like to kick the ball back and do my defensive strategies that I love to do. Or I like to call them cheats because they're very cheesy and uh, kind of like not allowed. And actually, they're not allowed in the NFL at all. Okay. You would never see a player doing that. And I'll get into that soon. That's like the third and fourth thing you should be doing. But onside kick is the second thing that you could do, right? And oh, wait. One of them is also closing the app, so that's the last one, but I'll get into that later, but also talk about it now. So, onside kicking, right? This is something you can do, and the method you should be doing is kicking it slow. There's also something saying if you draw a penalty, you also get the ball back, but whenever I draw a penalty, I never get the ball back. I have no clue. I just think it's 100% luck at the end of the day, so that's how I think about it, but you can easily kick the ball slow you just got to bring the ball up and like kick it slow up or something like that and yeah they always get the ball back i don't know so as you guys saw the defensive player had his hands on the ball so what you want to do from there on out is swipe out the app open it back up go back to this event and redo your onside kick now if you keep on doing that and you know your onside kick doesn't work then simply just kick it off and play on defense and i'm about to show you guys the defensive strategies that do work middle linebacker linebacker user him run through the middle sack the quarterback pressure him do all that running through the middle that's a nice cheese play that you can easily sack the quarterback with every single time and it will help yourself to get the ball back not as fast as you getting an onside kick recovery right but it will get you the ball back pretty quick and i hear a lot of people saying they chew the clock down i, I don't see that as much okay that's that's good. We did a good little defensive drive right there. If he did catch that, that was unfortunate. Defense was locked up. He had to throw it on the rush. You can usually run throughout the offensive line every single play. Sometimes it might not work, but most of the time you should easily rush through it. If you want to, guys, do blitz plays. If you don't, just do a good formation and then just, you know, use your middle linebacker, linebacker, go through the middle, cheese it up, sack the quarterback, put pressure on the quarterback so he throws a bad ball. So now for pump blocking, what you want to do is just select any play. Usually you do the suggested play and then pick a player and then go through the middle of both of those players and run through the middle of them and try to perfect it. And there we go. I did it. 
perfect turnover on downs and you're simply that close to score another touchdown you know you can do the onside kick hopefully get it back swipe the app up do all that then again you could do this play good defense do the cheese through you know selecting the middle linebacker linebacker go on your fourth down block the point like this get closer so you don't waste that much time going to the 25 now to score your touchdown and then you can you know uh, hopefully line up and score a touchdown fast i'm obviously not like okay I, I, okay i'm not obviously like here, let me lock in let me just see if i can score a touchdown in one play let's just say this was my given play after the point let's see if i can get it right just throw it up look at that touchdown perfect and then the last and final thing that i have been talking about throughout this video but i'm gonna just put it for the last and final thing just to wrap it up is that you can close the app as i was saying you know if you fail an outside kick you can close the app you can redo the onside kick if you fail you know doing the cheese and the go ahead and perfect the punt or he throws a touchdown right oh wow that was a good play right there then you can go ahead and close the app right if you get a pick six like that that's insane you know there is always luck throughout the game you just have to play and find a way if you don't get it on your first try you hopefully will get it on your second third or fourth or so on right i'm trying a different play right here Ooh, that that's that's a nice play right there try that is a halfback toss or something i don't know oh where's that the mountain play something like that hey look 25 to 28 i'm still in the third quarter that means i have a minute and 30 left to score i'm completing this challenge easily if i keep on using my cheese plays and perfecting everything just like that but these are the five best strategies that you guys need to do to go ahead and beat the super bowl comeback challenge number one was find the special play and focus on your time management two was onside kick perfecting that if you can if you can't kick it off and do the other things i showed you which is run through the middle using a middle linebacker linebacker doing the cheese throughout the offensive lineman just getting into the center both of them to rush to the quarterback and then fourth when you get to the fourth down to you know block the punt through the middle select anyone go to the same way you did the cheese to you know get to that fourth down point and then get the punt blocked hopefully you can actually like hit the ball because if you hit the ball you can force a fumble and recover and hopefully just score a touchdown right away but if you have to tackle the punter do that you get the ball right there and it's even better than getting the ball back at your own like 20 or something and also you can if they do punt it back to you return the punt i have been able to do that because this team overall is not an exact 7999 overall like it doesn't play like it it's not an actual like all madden difficulty you can run around these players so if you want if you don't get that pump blocked you can try that out to perfect it i've done it before so it is possible if your overall is lower than a 4000 it's going to be difficult to play the event a little bit but you know a 4000 above will obviously be beneficial to you know get it done so now that i showed you guys all of the cheesy plays and strategies i'm hoping you can go ahead now and complete the super bowl comeback challenge event for your free epic player and much more comment down below if these strategies helped you to beat it and or if you already beat it i know a lot of you guys have completed this challenge i know a lot of you guys haven't so that's why this video is put out so you guys can go ahead and perfect it these are things that i have done in my first video of the super bowl coming back challenge event that made me beat it i did get lucky here and there which i'm hoping you guys get lucky too there's always a side of luck and then stuff you can put in to perfect that so there you have it i'll catch you guys in the next one peace